I'm Kaushik Tannen. And I'm Anurag Singh. We are sophomores in high school and are excited to talk to you about Hand Washing Hemp, a computer vision system for monitoring effective hand hygiene. We all know that hand washing is one of the easiest ways to prevent the spread of disease. Yet evidence shows that 95% of people do not wash their hands correctly. The Center for Disease Control estimates that 1 million child deaths worldwide could be prevented through the use of proper hand washing. Hand washing is so important that the CDC has published a standard protocol as to how to wash the hands, which many do not know of. People in the healthcare and food industry are required to follow this protocol, as it is a public health concern. But there is no automatic, simple-to-use system that can monitor compliance. We wanted to solve this problem by creating a computer vision system to evaluate the hand washing technique of a user for compliance with the CDC protocol. Our system can detect if the hands are wet, if the hands are soapy, or if the hands are being rinsed. Let's take a look at our system in action. The hands first enter the frame. The water is turned on, soap is applied, and the hands are being rinsed. Our system can detect these various stages and evaluate the user's hand washing all in real time. Our methods are quite innovative. We use a depth camera to differentiate the hands from the background image and a water-powered faucet LED light to detect water. The light turns blue when the water is on. Perhaps the most interesting detector is the soap detector. We are able to detect the white foam by defining a threshold for what we consider to be soap. We divide the hands into patches to measure the overall amount of soap. Please take a closer look at our detectors and our results. Now, our next steps are to enhance the user interface and to conduct further testing. We want to eventually implement the system in hospitals, food industry, and even public restrooms so that anyone can help monitor their compliance with the hand washing protocol. We expect that this will reduce the transmission of disease caused by ineffective hand hygiene. Thanks very much for listening.